The main scanner paradigm we use consists of four conditions. Two of the conditions involve text and two involve video with sound. Half of the stories and videos involve scientific puzzles and the other half includes social interactions. This paradigm allows us to examine the effect of cognitive domain independently of the modality in which stimuli are presented. Each video or story is shown for 20 seconds, followed by a yes-no question, which participants have seven seconds to answer. The blocks are sometimes separated by longer periods in which only a fixation point is presented. This allows us to compare task performance with rest. In addition, the task blocks and rest blocks are long enough at 27 seconds for us to look at how the patterns of connectivity between brain areas that we see in the resting state are influenced by task conditions. The second scanner paradigm we are using involves looking at pictures of a variety of stimuli, including pictures of faces of family members and friends, unfamiliar faces of adults and children, animals, cute looking animals, computers, and houses. Intermixed with both these scanner paradigms, we present participants with pure fixation runs. These allow us to look at patterns of resting connectivity as discussed in the introduction.